everyone and welcome to my booktube channel. My name is Sarah and today I'm going to be doing a September book haul. September isn't even halfway over but I've already accumulated eight books. Very excited about it and also a little bit ashamed but I didn't spend that much money. I got them all really cheap. So let's just get straight into the books. The first book that I picked up this month was Legend by Marie Lu. I believe this is a dystopian novel and I'm not sure much else about it except all of my friends really love it and they were like you have to read this so I'm finally hopefully going to read it. I've loved the Young Elite series by Marie Lu. Her writing style is really great so I'm really excited to see what this book holds. The next book that I have here with me today is My Grandmother Asked Me to Tell You She's Sorry by Frederick Backman. I was actually sent this book by Simon & Schuster and Grace over at Loving Dem Books as a part of booktube tours. I am a host for this tour. I will have a review for this book coming up very soon. I'm actually halfway through it and really enjoying it so far. This book follows a seven-year-old girl named Elsa who is obsessed with Harry Potter and X-Men and her best friend is also her grandmother. They spend so much time together and they have this really special bond. And whenever they are together, her grandmother tells her these epic stories about a faraway magical land. But when Elsa's grandmother passes away from cancer, she leaves behind a series of letters apologizing to those she has wronged during her life. And she leaves those letters for Elsa to deliver. There is actually a giveaway for this book going on right now, so if you are interested in winning a beautiful copy of this book, I will leave the links to all of that information in the description box below. Thank you so much to everyone who had a part in sending me this book, and I can't wait to finish it. The next books that I got were Unravel Me and Furthermore by Tahara Mafi. I picked up Unravel Me because it's the sequel to Shatter Me, which I recently read last month and I really enjoyed. If you didn't see my monthly wrap up, I'll link it down below. And because because Tahara and her husband Ransom Riggs were coming on tour near me, I also picked up Furthermore, which is now signed. I will talk a little bit more about this in a signing vlog that is coming your way very soon, so stay tuned for that. Furthermore is a story about a colorless girl in a world full of color whose father has disappeared and she sets out to find him. This next book was sent to me by Soho Teen and Grace over at Loving Dem Books as a part of booktube tours, and that is Dark Courses by Cicely Vaughn. I feel like I'm going to butcher that, so I'm not even going to try. This is a book told from the perspective of both a young girl and her horse, which I think is super interesting and I'm eager to see how it plays out. This book follows a girl named Marit who is basically having a breakdown after the death of both her grandmother and her horse. She walks out of the SATs, she disappears, her parents are panicking and so they decide to send her to this equine assisted therapy program. That is where she meets her horse Red, who has never really been able to bond with anyone, but immediately they feel a connection. There is also a giveaway going on for this book, and so I will leave all the information that you need down below if you are interested in winning a beautiful copy of this book. The next book that I picked up this month was How to Hang a Witch by Adriana Mather. This book follows a girl by the name of Samantha, who is the descendant of one of the men who were responsible for the Salem witch trials, and she and her mother have just moved to Salem, Massachusetts, only to be met with hostility from a group of girls called the Descendants, who are descendants of the Salem Witch Trial girls. This seems super interesting and mysterious, and I cannot wait to read it. The next book that I have I did not buy, I actually won on Twitter, which is crazy and like rarely happens to me, but it's really cool, and that is The Last Cherry Blossom by Kathleen Birkinshaw. I won this as a part of a giveaway that the Sweet Sixteens were doing, the Sweet Sixteens are this really awesome supportive group of debut YA and middle grade authors that have books releasing in 2016. They did one of those random follow and retweet for a chance to win and I actually won which is crazy and who would have expected that. And then the author was kind enough to offer to sign it and she sent it herself and it was wonderful and she's so sweet oh my god. So she said Sarah may you enjoy what blossoms with each changing season and then Kathleen Birkinshaw her handwriting is so cute and squirrely. I believe this is a middle grade story and I'm not sure exactly what it's about but I know it has a lot of Japanese culture and Japanese culture is so fascinating to me and I can't wait to learn more. And then the last 
book that I picked up this month I have been waiting to get on my hands on for the longest time and that is Seventeen and Gone by Nova Rensuma. If you guys didn't know, I am a huge fan of Nova Rensuma and I own Imaginary Girls, which is her first book. This is her second one. I still need to pick up the Walls Around Us, which is our only other book. I have read them all and adored them. So slowly I'm just trying to own them myself. This is sort of a mysterious book, so I don't want to say too much about it, but essentially it follows this girl who is 17 years old and her name is Lauren and she is seeing these visions of other 17 year old girls who are disappearing. This book is so fascinating and twisty and turny, just like all of Nova and Suma's books are, so I highly suggest this one. These are the books that I picked up so far this month. It's crazy. I don't even know. I'm insane. And there are more books coming from the vacation that I took, but that's a whole separate issue that we'll get into later. <laughs> so that is it for today's video. You guys should let me know down below some of the books that you are most excited about picking up this month. If you guys like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you're new here. I post new videos twice a week. If you guys would like to follow me on Twitter or any of my social medias, I will leave the links to those in the description box below, as always. But most of all, I hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video, and I will see you in my next one. Goodbye!